Welcome into the Original Gangsters Podcast. I'm your host, Scott Bernstein. Quick hitter edition. We're going to New York City, the five families. The death of a Don. Dominic Quiet Dom Cirillo, one of the most respected and revered and trusted uh, mafia figures in the New York City's five families from the Genovese, uh, former capo, former acting boss, longtime consigliere, uh, close friend to Chin Gigante, passed away over the weekend. He was 94 years old. Um, this guy is a legends legend, um, in the five families, a guy that, uh, started his, uh, adult life as a boxer, like a lot of wise guys, you know, at that time in that era, um, transitioned in the 1950s or so into the narcotics trade. And from that, uh, became acquainted, uh, through his father, who was, a, I believe, a, um, a made guy, uh, acquainted, with uh, members of, of the Mafia in New York. He became very close to uh, Vincent the Chin Gigante when uh, the Chin was on the rise. Um, and then when Chin became the boss, uh, Quiet Dom was right next to him in that inner circle, one of his most trusted, if not his most trusted advisor. Um, when Chin finally got taken down by the feds in 97, I think it was the summer of 97, uh, he tapped Dom as his acting boss. Uh, Dom eventually went to prison in like 2005 ish, 2006 on a racketeering case. He came out of prison uh, in the late 2010s and became a uh, consigliere to the ghost of the West Side, Barney Belomo, most powerful mafia Don in America right now. Uh, we place it real close to the vest. Not a lot of pictures, not a lot of. Uh, public appearances uh, that's why we call him a ghost but uh barney and and his inner circle uh guys that are in their 50s 60s some in the early 70s they really leaned on uh quiet dom everybody loved this guy he like i said uh, he he hits all those uh checks all those boxes uh, beloved feared respected um so he passes away 94 years old. All the OGs are seem to be, you know, tapping out, uh, cashing their chips. That's just what happens. Uh, the cycle of life. Last thing I'll mention about Dom Cirillo, and this is where it gets a little salacious, I suppose. Um, we're 20 years removed from the disappearance and murder, suspected murder of uh, Dominic's son, Nikki. There is still a lot of mystery and innuendo rumors, questions that surround that disappearance. Uh, 20 years later, he disappeared in the spring of 04 after having uh, some altercations with the Bananos, specifically Vinny Bastiano, Vinny Gorgeous's people, Dom Chicali and, and Vinny's sons. Um, you know, I just want to be clear that through wiretaps and other things, the that that group, that Chicali Bastiano group, uh, adamantly denies they had anything to do with it. There were some sit downs. There was re recordings where Vinny Bastiano was telling uh, his boss at the time, Joe Messino, the first New York Godfather to um, wear a wire, where Messino's asking him about Nikki Cirillo and and uh, Vinny Bastiano saying they had nothing to do with us. That was all uh, coming from the Genovese. Again, we're not sure. Was it the Genovese? Was it the Bonanno? Was it both of them? Um, but I think the main question is that people ask, you know, 20 years later, what was Dominic, what was Quiet Dom's role in the demise of his son? Did he sign off on it? Um, Nikki was someone that was known to have a pretty bad drug addiction, was a uh, hair trigger temper, a guy that acted disrespectfully towards people that he shouldn't have been. Uh, did did Quiet Dom sign off on his murder, as it looks like Vinny Bastiano is alluding to, or did he have nothing to do with it? Um, again, we, we'll never know. Uh, I would guess the answers go to the grave with him. I know that Dom Chicali has said on some podcasts since he's jumped on to YouTube and Patreon that he would shed some more light on his perspective of the situation after Quiet Dom died. So maybe we'll we'll have that coming down the pike in the next couple of weeks or months. But uh, Quiet Dom Cirillo, uh, a true OG, New York Five Families, 
acting boss, conciliary, dead at 94. I'm Scott Bernstein, OG Pod out.